Hello. Uh, we are going to start the uh, baptism. So, ang inano ko lang, ituturo ko sa inyo yung tamang sagot and gusto ko lang marinig. Okay. Kayong mga parents at saka mga grandparents, ang iyong pong isasagot, sa, tak, sa katanungan ito ay baptism. Pakiulit po. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Parents and godparents, what do you ask for these children? Parents lang po ang sumasagot dito. Ang inyo pong, itut ang inyo pong itutugon is we do. Pakiulit po. <coughs> You have asked to have your children bap child baptized in doing so. Are you accepting the responsibility, parents, of training them in the practice of faith? It will be your duty to bring them up to keep God's commandments as Christ told us by loving God and our neighbor. Parents, do you clearly understand what you are undertaking? Kayong mga ninong at ninang, ang inyo pong itutugon is, we are. Pakiulit po. Are you ready, good parents, to help these parents in their duty as Christian mothers and fathers? By their children, the Christian community welcomes you with a great joy. In its name, I claim you for Christ our Savior. By the sign of the cross, kukrusan ko ang forehead ng mga anak nyo. Pagkatapos niyan, you follow parents and then get parents, okay? Kukrusan niyo po, parents. Tapos kayo mga ninong at ninang din. The Lord be with you. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Mark. People were bringing the little children to Jesus to have them touch them, but the disciples were scolding them for this. Jesus became indignant when he noticed it and said to them, Let the children come to me and do not hinder them. It is just such as this that the kingdom of God belongs. I assure you that whoever does not accept the kingdom of God like a little child shall be not enter into it. Then he embraced them and blessed them, placing his hands on them. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise the Lord Jesus Christ. Ngayon po, the renunciation of sin and the profession of our faith. Dear parents and godparents, you have come here to present these children for baptism by the water and the Holy Spirit. They are to receive the gift of the new life from God, who is love. On your part, you must make it your constant care to bring them up in the practice of faith, see that the divine life which God gives them is kept safe from the pious and of sin to grow always stronger in their hearts. Now listen, if your faith makes you ready to accept this responsibility, renew now the vows of your baptism, reject sin, Profess your faith in Christ Jesus. This is a faith of the church, and this is a faith which these children is about to be baptized. Parents and godparents, ang iyo pong itutugon sa mga katanungan ito is, I do. Pakiulit po. Do you reject sin 
so as to the freedom of God's children? Do you reject the glamour of evil and refuse to be mastered by sin? Do you reject Satan, father of sin and prince of darkness? Do you believe in the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth? Do you believe in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was born of the Virgin Mary, was crucified, died, and was buried, and rose again from the dead, and is now seated at the right hand of the Father? Do you believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body and life everlasting? This is our faith, and this is a faith of the Church. We are too proud and profess it in Christ Jesus, our Lord. Amen. Ito ngayon, ang huling tanong. Ang yung itutugod is, it is, pakiulit po, it is your will that these children should be baptized in the faith of church which we have all professed with you. Ibabaptize natin yung mga bata. God, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, this would be anointing with a grazing, has freed you from sin, given you a new birth by the water and the Holy Spirit, and welcome you into his holy people. He now anoints you with the charism, the charism of salvation, as Christ was anointed priest, prophet, and king. You may you live always as members of His body, sharing the everlasting life. Amen.
talaga yung sobrero ng bata. Yung tatay po, sindihan niyo yung kandila, meron kayo. Sindihan niyo po ang kandila. Doon po sa... Sandali lang ka, dahil baka. My dear children, you have become a new creation and have clothed yourselves in Christ. See in this white garment the outward sign of your Christian dignity with your family and friends to help you by word and example, bring that dignity and stain into the everlasting life of heaven. Amen. Receive the light of Christ, parents and godparents. This light is entrusted to you to be kept burning brightly this children is yours, have been enlightened by Christ. They are to walk always as children of the light. May they keep the flame of faith alive in their hearts. When the Lord comes, may they go out to meet Him with all the saints in the heavenly kingdom. Dearly beloved, these children had been reborn in baptism. They are now called children of God, for so indeed they are. In confirmation, they will receive the fullness of God's Spirit. In Holy Communion, they will share the banquet of Christ's sacrifice, calling God their Father. In the midst of the Church, in the name of the Spirit, in our common sonship, let us pray together in the words that our Lord has given us. Tayong lahat po. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from all evil. May God the Father and model of all Father help these fathers to give a good example. So that their children will grow to be mature Christians in all the fullness of Jesus Christ. Amen. May God who loves all people bless all God parents, relatives, and friends who are gathered here. And in his mercy, may he guard them from evil and give them his abundant peace. Amen. May God, the source of life and love, fill so the hearts of the mothers with the love of the children, and bless the mother of these newly baptized children. As they thank God for a safe delivery, may they find the love and growth of holiness in their children. Amen. The baptism has been done. Go in peace, and the mighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Congratulations. Palapakan po natin ang mga bata.